There have been a number of changes this year for the Chillicothe Transit System, and one of those is coming this weekend. It is the trolley making a return. We'll talk about that and some other changes that have been made coming up in just a moment as we visit with Osti Powell, Aaron Kennedy, and Bill Menendez. Coming up next. Introducing Budweiser Zero. Zero percent alcohol, zero grams of sugar, full Budweiser flavor. For all the moments you want a beer and need to stay on your game. Budweiser Zero. Zero compromise. Downtown, of course, last year you tested and... Since then, you've purchased yes. <laughs> a yes. new trolley. Uh, talk about the excitement of putting this thing on the, on the streets. Last year, um, we, we did a, we, we call it, it was a prototype, a trolley trial, and this was part of the innovation track. Um, it, it was honestly kind of short notice, um, but from the feedback that was generated, in, in two days we had over 750 riders. Uh, coming from all over the place, from Columbus. We've had out-of-state people mm -hmm. coming to the trolley. It blew our minds. Like, we were thinking this is either going to hit really big or it's going to miss really big. Well, it hit big, um, and since then, that was in July, I believe, mm -hmm. since then we've had continuous calls. Um, hey, when's the trolley coming? When's the trolley coming? And so um, we, we have purchased the trolley, and it's ready to roll. Yeah. You got a date? June 10th. June 10th, we'll be rolling it out. Um, I think the other piece that's really exciting is because we purchased it, uh, we have a lot of flexibility with it. And so one of the things that we did when we tested the trolley was, again, talk to the residents. Like, what do you think? What do you like? What don't you like? What would you like to see? Mm -hmm. And once again, like the, the community showed up and had a lot of great ideas. And so by purchasing the trolley, we have a lot of flexibility to test out those ideas. Um, I recall several families uh, with young kids were getting on and they're like, we love this. It gives us like an op opportunity to get out with the kids and get fresh air. Um, they had input on what the routes look like. So when we did the two day test, it was kind of like pretty core downtown, just it's two days, we got to test something. Um, and I know one of the initial feedback was like, we love this. Can you also go to the library and the park? Because those are the two free things that are in the area. And so maybe we um, aren't able to get out and purchase dinner or whatnot, but like we can still bring the family down and still connect to those two resources. And so I'm really excited because it seems to connect like a wide range of folks and demographics. like. Older couples, young families, individuals, um, and so for me that's exciting, and that's just within this downtown loop. So when we roll out June 10th, um, we have a three-month schedule lined out. We're going to test two main ideas, or, or we're going to run with two ideas. Um, Fridays and Saturdays we'll do an extended downtown loop that incorporates the park and the pump house and the library as well as multiple stops throughout downtown uh, for folks that want to do shopping or eating or visitors coming in. Um, Tuesday we'll be running an evening route between the uh, series of hotels that are off of Bridge Street down to the downtown. Uh, that was feedback we received as well. The hotels um, seem to stay full Monday through Wednesday with different executives and transporting coming in and they want to go downtown but maybe they're not sure how to get around or where to park and so again just another draw to, to support our local businesses. Um, but that's just the three month schedule and so after that we'll be rolling out other ways to use the trolley, going into residential neighborhoods. Um, we could go out to Tecumseh, we can schedule historical tours, and so it'll be just really fun over the next year to continue to talk to the community and say, I don't know, let's try that. Like, we haven't done it and the trolley makes sense, and, and that can be a fun way to engage a different group or, um, you know, engage a different neighborhood. And so uh, that is that is where we are right now, but a lot more um, movement and activity and um, scheduling to come on it. And you've been through the process of getting the trolley. World Heritage kicks in. Yep. You may look at getting another one or two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to argue that. <laughs> That'd be cool. Yeah, yeah, I think so. It's. I think the other thing that's um, neat is because of the way the community viewed it with like as a solution for things that we weren't necessarily meaning it a solution to be. So for us, you know, the transit's for everyone, public transit's for everyone. Um, but we understand 
not everyone's going to get on a bus like they have their personal vehicle and so in our idea and talking to the community during the innovation track like the trolley was a unique way for everyone to participate and get on even if they don't have their own personal vehicle at home um, but in that you know we did the the, the downtown tour and we had a couple folks get on, um, have some mobility issues, and they're like, this is great, I love coming downtown, but I have to park over here, and I actually can't walk everywhere. And so in their mind, they're like, what a great solution for parking. And I was like, that's not what it was, but if that's what, it, if that's what helps, then that's what helps. And then same thing you know, with the families, like, this gives us something fun and exciting to do. Like, you're right, it does, let's, let's continue on that. So that's been pretty cool to kind of watch how people recognize it and how they see it fit for their particular family in the community. It kind of gives the idea of having the, the broader community take a fresh look at transit. Yep. Um, so that's that kind of the hook and then you know hey we have on demand and, and you know the fixed routes that we've redone as well so it kind of pulls it all together.